प्रेम बाबा प्रेम बाबा जय महादेवा बनाओ 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 राइट नाउ बनाओ 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 राइट नाउ आई कॉन्ट रोमांस एनी वन बिकॉज फर्स्ट कहीं तो होगा फ्रॉम टेलीविजन डेज आई don't remember having romance to anyone on screen why rajiv i think most people would be very shy when you come to these things including myself this is soundtrack which is again uh, very very different from the kind of stuff that i've done uh, in the past i think soundtrack is a beautiful story i think it's an honest film i think it's got a brilliant narrative i am rajiv pandelwal the a very ordinary guy uh, after my pack up when i'm working i'm an actor that's uh, what my profession demands the way i am doing films my films come out once in 6 months one year so obviously i have all the reasons to be excited about my third release and uh, this is soundtrack which is again uh, very very different from the kind of stuff that i have done uh, in the past and not just from my own work i think it's a very different film in terms of films you uh, i'm very very sure that this is going to be one of its kind uh, this is going to change the perspective of a lot of people this is going to rewrite um, film making because uh, the way nirav has nirav ghosh is the director of the film the way he has told the story i think uh, it's a very very uh, it's very very refreshing uljano ke hai pahar samne agar khod ke bana lunga main khud apni dagar sab pata ye tune banaya kaisa hai maine kabhi suna nahi ye kaise i am very excited for show i mean 30th is coming up uh, and uh, we like you said it's an extremely different film in the sense that uh, it's exciting and it's narrative it's exciting and the characters in it exciting as a film per se as a story we've all taken on certain people certain characteristics certain characters that have pushed our boundaries so i'm counting up days and anxiety is growing now <laughs> It was difficult for me to keep Nirav convinced that please take me. <laughs> for me, when I'm offered a challenging role, when I'm offered a film like Soundtrack, I'm the one who is more excited than a director, and I always live with the fear that maybe very soon he's going to change his mind and say, "Nay, Rajiv, uh, maybe somebody else." So uh, for me to <laughs> keep Nirav convinced was a bigger task. Uh, as far as I'm concerned, the moment I hear a script and the first feeling is, "Can I pull this off?" This makes me nervous. I mean if I get that feeling I love being part of that film because that is challenging. So for me it was very very easy for Nirav to convince me to do something uh, like what I'm doing on screen. I on the onset knew I wanted to be a part of this film because I wanted to be a part of this film. It's it's a, it was a great story and uh, again I mean the character I'm playing Shanali was a challenge unto herself. Now this is somebody that I haven't portrayed or played before ever. And uh, and yes, there's a lot of nervousness, like Rajiv said, uh, the sheer nervousness of taking on this character that you don't really know or have met or found within yourself. Uh, but then again, that becomes your excitement factor as an actor. And um, of course, Nirav, uh, one has met and known before, and uh, the sheer competence of the man and and uh, his his brilliance sort of translates across the table. And right there, you know that you want to be part of something that you sense is going to be magical. चार्ली मेरे पास एक आइडिया है मैं सोच रहा हूँ डॉक्टर के पास चले जाऊँ आई वॉज सो एक्साइटेड एंड आई वॉज वेरी नर्वस आई एम ऑलवेज वेरी नर्वस वन आई एम स्टार्टिंग वर्क विद न्यू को एक्टर एंड मोर देन एनथिंग एल्स बिकॉज आई सीन राजीव फिल्म एंड एंड ऑल्सो हिज प्रीवियस वर्क फ्रॉम टेलीविजन एंड इमेंस इमेंस अमाउंट ऑफ रिस्पेक्ट हिम एज एन एक्टर एंड I think it's 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 a humbling experience sometimes to work with someone who you put in such high esteem. So I was very excited. No, I was equally nervous by the way. <laughs> I was equally nervous because in the last two films I didn't have a female lead. And then here I'm thrown next to someone as pretty and hot as she is and I'm asked to uh, uh, romance her. 
<laughs> so you can imagine my state of uh, excitement and nervousness both. Well, I played Rajiv's girlfriend in the first half, uh, and subsequently, I mean, like it's, it's a, a phase that we're going through. So characteristically, she is someone who is. Uh, uh, extremely aggressive, extremely um, confrontational, in your face, uh, very, very confident. Um, she owns a room when you, she walks in and she's put in these circumstances. So, I mean, I know that she, everyone says, and I do know that she has these very grey shades to her, uh, perceived grey shades, but I think that she is an entity unto herself and she is many, many people that I've met out there. I'm a director's actor. I followed whatever he had to tell me. I followed his vision and for me, um, I don't think I've ever played any character with a lot of ease. I've always had to struggle and always had to work very, very hard on each character of mine, each characters of mine which I've played either on television or on films. So it wasn't really easy, it's never been easy, uh, but it wasn't my um, interpretation of Ronak. I was just being myself and but I was working in, uh, in the boundaries set by Nirav Ghosh. So I would say whatever I am on screen, whatever this film is, wherever it takes us, takes all of us to, um, we should give all the credit to Nirav Khosh because it is this one man's vision. Mr. Call, apne lifestyle ke baare mein batayiye kuch. Drinks achhe lagte hain. Beer ko bhi include karna hai. Of course, yar. Charti to usse bhi hai. I met Rajiv the first day I was on set. Uh, I met Soha on set one day. We sadly haven't gotten to work together at all, but. Uh, uh, she and I know each other from way back. For me, uh, my work from the word go has been uh, the, the, the background work that's happened has been Nirav all the way. Um, it's been him uh, trying to bring about this transformation. Like he cat categorically, there was a makeover on various, various, various levels which just don't stick to the physicality of the character but also, you know, just who she is in her portrayal, her aggressiveness, her uh, the reasons why she is who she is, how does she walk, why does she do this, what goes on between uh, Ronak and Shanali, why does it happen, so on and so forth. So um, we, we literally used to sit every other day with the script of her coffee and have discussions, uh, post which then, I mean, of course, there's a certain amount of internalization which has to happen uh, because this is someone who's not really someone that I kind of uh, identify with a lot. Post that, I mean, it's been such a great time on set because uh, bulk of my work's been with Rajiv. Uh, some of it has been with Mohan Kapoor. That was actually a really fun scene. Um, so uh, it's, it's been a wonderful, wonderful experience. I can't romance anyone because <laughs> post Kahi to Hoka from television days, I don't remember having romanced anyone on screen. And I had this romantic image. So for me, yes, I was a bit nervous. But uh, I think I had wonderful co-stars who made my, um, my journey uh, in this film so comfortable. I mean, I, I was a bit apprehensive of working with uh, Mrinalini and of course Soha, both of them. And both of them are very different characters in the film. So I was definitely apprehensive. But from day one itself, I think um, the environment was so... Um, Relaxed. Yeah, so relaxed and so peaceful. And, and uh, I mean, I had some difficult scenes with uh, Mrinalini. And uh, they weren't very difficult on the day of the shoot because we had discussed the scenes so openly, so uh, uh, comfortably that uh, everything was like cakewalk, finally. So uh, all the apprehensions were went out of the window once I met these two lovely ladies. And uh, I think uh, we pulled out a great chemistry, uh, me and Banalni and me and Soha together. Hamesha, Dusha, Ashta hota hai. Aur mushki? Was beautiful. Why Rajiv? I think most people would be very shy when you come to these things, including myself. Um, but that's what we're here to do, right? We're actors. And when we've taken on a certain film which has a certain narrative factor, then, uh, and if that includes a certain amount of romancing, etc., then at that point in time, you leave your apprehensions, you work them out before and you come and you perform as professionals on set. Well, nothing has come my way because I haven't been successful till now. So I'm still <laughs> waiting for things to come my way. <laughs> right now it's only struggle, it's all about uh, getting my films right, it's all about reaching a point. Uh, whatever little I have uh, probably uh, gathered in my journey till now, uh, I've always believed that we all are supposed to live on earth. This is the place to stay, you don't fly, up, fly in the air. As most of the people say, um, down to earth, I've never understood that whole phrase, where else is one supposed to stay, if not on earth. So uh, I think that's the philosophy that I've lived with. And uh, I've also detached myself from, 
from the actor Rajiv Pandelwal. I am Rajiv Pandelwal, the, a very ordinary guy. Uh, after my pack-up, when I'm working, I'm an actor. That's uh, what my profession demands. Other than that, I love going back to my house as Rajiv Khandelwal, who is as superior or as inferior or as ordinary as anyone else. I think that one's definition of success is very varied and uh, I'm still journeying. Success isn't there yet. Uh, but for what it's worth, um, and no, I haven't actually come across the, the lifestyle, personally, per se, uh, that we've sort of depicted in the film at that point, that phase in the film. But uh, I do know and I do believe that every human being has a choice. And uh, if, if given that choice, I think I choose to walk away because uh, there's something very beautiful about living life and I would rather live life than destroy life. In my life, I have never done that I am working for something and after that I didn't get that thing because of my fault. I have kept this thing in mind that when the opportunity will knock on the opportunity and when it will knock on the opportunity, उस दिन ऐसा ना हो कि मैं बोलूं कि सॉरी मुझे थोड़ा टाइम दीजिएगा मेरी ये कमी हो गई है मुझ में ये कमज़ोरियां हैं मैं इसे पूरी करके आता हूं तब तक आप वेट कीजिएगा बिकॉज अपॉर्चुनिटी किसी के लिए वेट नहीं करती है तो हर वक्त जब मैं स्ट्रगल कर रहा था जब मेरे पास बिल्कुल भी काम नहीं था जब मैं मुझे कोई नहीं जानता था तब सिर्फ एक ही चीज़ मैं दिमाग में रहता था और वो यही थी कि आप हमेशा तैयार हैं यू ने बनो बैन अपॉर्चुनिटी बिल्कुल मैं नॉक ऑन डॉ आई मच अग्री विद एवरी थिंग we're all, uh, we all work towards where we want to be in life. Sometimes it's defined, sometimes it's not defined. But yeah, I mean, when opportunity knocks, you just have to be ready for it. And uh, for me, I'm perpetually inventing or trying to reinvent myself in some way or the other. It just keeps life interesting. And at the same time, broadens your perspective and horizon as well. So, you have to be that you're always prepared. Uh, no, I haven't actually come across a situation per se where uh, I've really struggled hard and it's not happened. Uh, the point is, it's happening every single day. <laughs> actually, there are 12 films in this film and 12 films are so beautiful that you have a new favorite every day. And my real life is a new favorite every day. Whether it's an atomizer, whether it's a temple, whether it's a chanat, whether it's a temple, whether it's a temple, whether it's a Naina Kailash Khirka song, whether it's a temple, दूसरे सॉन्ग्स हों, I think all of them, चाहे वो रीमिक्सेस हों, रुक जाना नहीं तो कहीं हार के, I think हर रोज़ एक गाना सुन सकते हैं और फिर वापस सात दिन के बाद रिपीट कर सकते हैं, फिर बारह दिन के बाद वापस रिपीट कर सकते हैं। I think जो जो कुछ भी गाने हैं बारह के बारह, they're reflective of different moods, because you've covered so many genres in one album. तो actually मुझे realise नहीं हुआ इस बारे में ना कि � बनाओ बनाओ तो फेब में आप सुन सकते हैं एक मंजिल मार्च में आप फिर दूसरा सुन सकते हैं मौसम के हिसाब से गाने बदलिए फर्स्टली आई नेवर बीन डेस्परेट इन लाइफ सेकेंडली लॉट ऑफ पीपल इनिशियली यूज टू वॉन्ट मी वही लोग जो मुझे पहले बोलते थे कि यार पागल है तो ये क्या आमिर कर रहा है पहली फिल्म की तरह से डोंट डू सच का सामना राइट ना बिकॉज़ यू आर फिल्म करियर जस्ट स्टार्टेड सो डोंट गो बैक एंड ऑन टीवी सेम सेट ऑफ पीपल ना कमेंट्स हैं यू आर बड़ी स्मार्ट गाय है यू न्यू एक्जेक्टली हाउ टू कीप शैटरिंग द इमेज ऑल द टाइम पहले तूने ये किया फिर तूने कहा कि ये नहीं करूँगा मैं सच का सामना करता हूँ और अब फिर तूने शैतान के अब तो साउंड ट्राई कर रहा है मुझे मेरे पास कोई चॉइस नहीं थी मुझे जो अच्छी फिल्में लगी मैंने कर ली अब किसी को वो स्ट्रैटेजी नजर आती है तो ठीक है सोचे लेकिन सच बात ये मैं बहुत ही I'm a guy who just works runs on his instincts that's my strategy I think soundtrack is a beautiful story I think it's an honest film I think it's got a brilliant narrative I think uh, our director Nirav Ghosh has put together a film that's going to make you laugh it's going to make you cry it's going to it's going to leave you with a lump in your throat and it's going to make you walk out feeling good as a person it has great music and it has some very interesting characters. Everything pretty much what Mirani just said. <laughs> but uh, the other attractive things in the film, of course, is Manali, Soha, and Lost Trudy. <laughs> so please come and watch the film. Uh, this is going to be a completely brand new experience of uh, watching a Hindi film.
क्लास में प्रेम बाबा प्रेम बाबा जय महादेवा प्रेम बाबा प्रेम बाबा जय महादेवा बनाओ 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 राइट नाउ बनाओ 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 राइट नाउ